So guys, for the first method, you wanna head over to search and type in check for updates. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you wanna click on check for updates. Make sure the computer is fully up to date. For the next method, you wanna head over to search and type in CMD. Now you want to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. And then once you're on this, you want to type in power cfg space forward slash requests. Click on enter. It's going to be showing you right here if you have any applications or devices that's preventing your device from sleeping. If you see any device or application here, make sure that you close it. And if they're still not working, for the next method, you want to stay on command prompt. We're now going to type in msdt.exe space dash id space power diagnostic. Click on enter. And now this will come up. We're going to run this. So you want to click on next. Wait for this to load. If it detects anything, it will try to fix it for you. For the next method, you want to head over to search and type in device manager. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you want to expand keyboards. You want to repeat what I'm going to show you right now for all the keyboards that appear on this list. So you want to right click on your keyboard and then click on properties and then click on the power management tab. You want to untick allow this device to read the computer and then click on OK. And if you have any more keyboards showing in this list, you want to do the same thing for those ones as well. Now, once you do that for all the keyboards, you want to repeat this for the mice. So now you want to expand mice and other pointing devices and then do the same thing. Right click on it, properties, power management. You want to untick allow this device to read the computer and then click on OK. For the next method, you want to head over to search and type in edit power plan. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you want to click on power options on the top. Now you want to click on choose what the power buttons do. You want to select change settings that are currently unavailable. And where it says turn on fast start up, you want to turn this off. You want to untick this and then click on save changes. Now you just want to restore your computer. And then hopefully this will fix your problem. 